Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my new subscribers. I am glad that you're here. I tell you what, I've been using a free like editor that I got off of the Play Store. Well, and it, it really does just about everything the other channels do, but I can't do voiceover. They don't have, uh, anyways, it, it was very, very basic. So I went and I purchased a new movie there. I tell you, I had so much trouble out of it. First of all, they never sent the link to, or the key to activate it. I contacted them. They got back to me this morning. I'll give them that they did quick service for that. Gave me the link. Put it in there. I bought a uh, package from them for to use an intro or whatever. They did come with it. Again, I had to contact them. I mean, they just have been a headache. So I will be using the movie editor, and I am not sure how that's going to work out. I do have another one, and I, I just really need to get hold of that company to find out my password what have you, but in any case, I have a, a magazine today. And I got this off of eBay from Care for One. Yeah, she's not a company, she she just has auctions. I ordered this on the first no on the tenth of February. Today's the 28th, it got here. She shipped it on the 15th, and I got it today. But this, it says China, so I don't know how the heck it got that fast here with the virus thing. Gave it a bag, as you can see. It's not a large pain. If you see the boss my life, I do large. And okay, it's okay. As you can see, the back part well, it's got creases from it's falling, but nothing that you can't put underneath, layered out, or Oops, just put this here. I ironed out. Oh, it's got some tears. I may have did that though. There is a tear here, but I think I did that with my Zeko knife. Okay. It comes with a basic kit, as we can, as you can see. Let's turn this around. It is poured blue. It has a total of 19 colors. And here it is. I am not going to take the plastic off right now uh, because I will put this off. I take the plastic off. I don't like them. Uh, and I replace it, replace it with the paper. Anyways, here is the somatic. It does have dark color, so I will have to use the uh, light pad. But I, I, my eyes are bad, so I use light pads. Anyways, the, all the glue is really, really good. Uh, I want this for eight dollars. I've got several more coming in that I bid on. Sorry, dude. There's one guy on there that I always buy from. Uh, DP's from. He doesn't have a company. He just he basically goes bids on them and then when he gets them, he puts them up for re 
So what have you? Have you I have been in against him many times, and so every time I do, I win. And I can understand because he's not willing to pay too much because he's got to turn around and sell and make money. But I won this for about eight dollars. I really, really like it. It that's gonna look cool. Okay, let's look at the drills. Mute you for phone if you don't want to hear this. Now what I don't like about this, <coughs> it doesn't have the DMC code <coughs> there, but they do have a schematic on both sides. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, they don't even have it on the drills, unfortunately. It has the account, how many are in there, and not the DEAC number, and I really, really don't like that. <coughs> and the reason I don't like it is if you run out, when you buy from auction, if you run out, you're just out. There's nothing. You've got to go buy your bills, because you bought it at auction, you know. I don't know what they mean by this 200, maybe you guys know, uh, but it says 200 on all of them, and I know so it can't be the amount, but in any case, here we go, we got some purples, 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 200, Let's see. I like it. Uh, these are, is this squares or? Yeah, they're circles. Uh, I do give some of my DPs by eBay auction. I usually don't. Uh, you can if, if if you're not real super rich and you're limited income and uh, you can't spend a lot. eBay is probably going to be your best effort. Just put DP auctions. Uh, the ones I got coming in, I've only paid three, four dollars for, and they're going to be the same, basically the same size as this one. There is a risk, though, doing these auctions on eBay. Um, sometimes they're not the best quality, so what I advise to do, if you're going to bid on it, check the seller's reviews, you know, that's a good indication. Uh, a little hint, I've heard people say you buy stuff on eBay, you, there's really no guarantee, you can't get a guarantee. That's not quite true. And I'm going to tell you the secret on how you get them to give you a guarantee when there is basically no guarantee. Their ratings is very, very important. Once you put a rating in, it can't be revised. But you can't, I can't just go in and do it. So what you do is you leave a neutral, a neutral, review and just tell them what's wrong with it. Don't bother contacting because they're going to tell you no. So that's all I do. I just tell them, you know, I'm not happy with the canvas or I'm not happy with the product. This is why 
Um, and I leave it. 100% of the time, these individuals got back to me and says, I will make this right with you. I will send you a new canvas or I'll refund your money. I, I will, you know, and I'll make it right if you are willing to revise your review. And what I tell them, I says, I'd be happy to. You first make it right. As soon as I see it, see it I'll let you know and I will revise it. I only had one time really, was it eBay? Yeah, it was eBay. I was looking, it's when I first started my channel and I was wanting to get a camera because my computer's camera it ain't that good. So I was looking for camcorders and I see this one and he kind of falsely advertised it, uh, everything, and I bought it. And I had even asked him, I says, look, I got a YouTube channel, this is what I'm using for, for. well, it uses SD card. He goes, oh yeah, it will. Well, the thing was so old you couldn't buy an SD card for it, okay? I mean, the machine worked fine, but you couldn't buy a card for it anymore. Because it didn't take SD cards, it took something else. I contacted him, I told him why I wasn't happy, and I wanted to ship it back to him. I wanted him to pay to have it shipped back, and I wanted my money back. He refused. Um, I opened up a dispute. Okay? I, I stayed in my case. Uh, they went, because I had argued with the guy back and forth for a while. They went through our messages back to each other. They looked at the original posting and ruled in my favor and he, he had to take the money back. He had, I mean, he had to take the money back, I sent it back, he sent me my money back. The only reason he did that, had he failed to do it, when eBay ruled in my favor, he would have lost his privileges. So you see, there is ways to get it resolved, to get uh, them to back up their paintings. If you know you contact them, they don't want, you know, just leave them a neutral. I guarantee you they're going to come back to you asking you to revise it and willing to make it right. Now, of course, every time they made it right, I did revise it. Okay? To give you an example, I bought this 99 set DP. And I bought it off of eBay. It came and it did not have any glue on it at all. Of course, now I know I realize I could have bought some, which I'm happy to do because my Evermama custom on one section that looks like the glue's gone, so I had to order some double sided tape. For one, Ever, Evermama right now is closed, it says um, on vacation. I pray to God they're not closed there, which is a shame because I know I could have emailed them, they would have sent because I've done this with them past. They would have sent me a new canvas. Uh, I, I don't trust anybody else other than Pretty Neat to do customs. Uh, small custom DAC is okay, but nothing's like ever, Mommy, you know? So I'm keeping my fingers crossed. It's just to this. They may decide to shut the doors so this virus crap is over with and reopen. That's what I'm praying. I know this virus thing has hurt a lot of companies. I seen one I was going to buy with. I had already registered. I went to go to the site. It's no more. Any buy or whatever. They apparently are out of business because I go to their site. I try to find them and it just says page can't be found. I, there's just no finding them. Anyways, 
So eBay is probably the, if you're really tight on money and you want a DP to do, eBay is your answer. Now, I said I would never, ever, ever put giveaway in my description. I t actually took this advice off of Miss Coffee on a post she, she did. I think it was either a video or a, a post, but it was from Miss Coffee, and she was saying to me when you do your giveaways, don't put giveaway because people will go search for giveaways, subscribe to your channel, then after the drawing, they leave. And I think she's very smart. I took her advice. Thank you, Miss Coffee. Uh, so there is going to be a giveaway this for the month. I'm doing it a day early because I can't. Uh, I ain't going to be posted tomorrow. I got things I got to do. Uh, and since a lot of the companies are back and running, including Pretty Neat. Oh, foot now, a DAC, folks, if you want a DAP from them, you better get over there. I just ordered last night. They got, they got limited uh, supplies. So if you're listening to this, you better not wait. If you want a Diamond Art Club painting, you got to go over there now. Now back to the giveaway. It's going to be from Pretty Neat. It is going to be a $50 gift certificate. And how that is going to work is I will, on the last day of the month, on the 28th, no, on the 29th, I will pick the winner. So you got from now to the 29th, and the reason I do so long is for one thing, I got to do it towards my my budget, and when I get my checks, and I am on disability, social, SSI, Social Security, disability thing, so that's the way I have to do it. Nobody sponsors, pretty neat, it's not sponsoring it. Let, let me make that clear. It's coming out of my own pocket. All my giveaways, are from my own pocket. The only one I did was um, Treasure Art Studio, because I, I had done a giveaway from them and I was telling her over there, and the next thing I know, she emailed me, wanted to sponsor her giveaway on my channel, which was so surprising, and, but, it, even she did that even though it was a small child and one of the reasons she did that is because I think she has a special thing with a uh, uh, relationship with diamond art addiction because she goes since you're part of the vibe tribe family uh, I would like to sponsor a painting up to 60 there uh, on that one I did not require you to be subbed because she was sponsoring it it was open there has already been drawn it went to Dave. He still hasn't got it because she couldn't ship, so he should be getting it. And I'm hoping he does. And I'm, I gotta contact him. He he will let me know. But I, when he does, I gotta find out what DP he did because I forgot. It is be absolutely beautiful. I've been wanting to get one for myself. Anyways, it will be from Diamond. From me, I'm sponsoring it. But it's going to be a $50 certificate. Too pretty neat. They are my favorite, 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 they're not asking me to say this. They're, they've gone to poured, glued only. And 
Oh God, what's that smell? Oh, it's that popcorn. <coughs> Poor glued. Um, Sitting in a tube. I mean, it's like, wow. It is. It's not on their custom. It's a lot of people think pretty neat. So we do it on their custom. And then that, that is totally untrue. And anyways, I better quit rumbling and let you guys go. Love you. I appreciate you being here. If you're new, please subscribe. Um, tomorrow on my Facebook, I'm going to be drawing for the pin. So if you want to get on that, go to Facebook. I don't know how to do the link on it. You just have to put in the thing. When you search for good group, let's put Diamond Painting Dreamer. It will come up. And it is posted there. Um, I got, so be sure to leave a comment. Don't worry. I know right now it shows four comments on there, but I know how to get all the comments and how I'm going to do that tomorrow is I'm going to have to write everybody's name on a piece of paper, put it in a bowl, mix it up, and then I'm going to have to grab a, uh, somebody around here. I'll figure that out tomorrow. The tenant, I usually can. They're, you know, the tenants here are, been, they know i got a YouTube channel. They have been, and I do my stuff here in the kitchen. And when they see me, if they come in, they walk so they're not on camera. They're very, very quiet, like the guy who did the popcorn. I bet you didn't hear him. He went in very quietly, put it in there, started his popcorn. No interruption. So, you know, I, I really appreciate it because the tenants are really good about it when I, when I do my thing. They're, they're real quiet, and I, I surely appreciate that. So anyways, happy diamond painting, and I will see you next time.